very tense situation for the Australian batsman. That's in the air. That's a better shot. Got more bat onto that one. That's four runs. That's a confidence ball for Greg Chappell. It wasn't all that short. And the big crowd roar. They're awake. Yes, that will do a lot for his confidence. One of Greg Chappell's favourite shots. This almost a combination shot of his favourite flick off the hip and a part pull shot. It came right off the middle of the bat. With Richards. Now comes in to Greg Chappell. It's counter, it's on. We'll take two, that brings up the 50 for Australia. Four for 51. And in fact, Robin had to move a little bit quicker this time. He turned hitting the stumps, but the batsman was well home. Desmond Haynes there, four for 73. Greg Chappell has had little luck at the crease in the last few innings, but he's certainly making up for lost time today. And he's clobbered that one into the outfield. Haynes coming around, just can't make the catch, but makes a good save. He wasn't far away from him, was in the air for a long time. And Haynes just couldn't get around in time. So four for 81. Viv Richards now comes in to Greg Chappell. And that's over the top. Under it goes Logie, and just manages to get the right hand to it and can't hold on. Difficult swirling catch. Richards applauds the effort by Logie. Larry Gomes off spin to Greg Chappell. Looking to Frank and shy at the stumps there by Logie, and that would have been out. And that could so easily have been another run out and Greg Chappell then would have been the victim. The umpire beautifully placed him. Viv Richards now comes in to Greg Chappell. And again, Chappell drives and there more runs. This time they'll get two. And this is more like the Chappell that we know of old. Far more authority coming into his front foot strokes. Larry Gomes off spin to Greg Chappell. Chappell sweeps and sweeps well right into the gap. The ball going down towards the square leg boundary but holding very quick coming across there. Cutting it off with his foot. And let's have a look at this throw. He's got a great arm. A little shy down the bowler's end. Bouncing the ball to Larry Gomes. Six for 170. Well it's holding back into the attack now. Off his short run. And Chappell... Straight away, flicking away to the leg. Will this be four? It will be close. Andy Roberts gets his foot in and it flicks up and it bounces down for four. So Andy Roberts trying the footwork down there at fine leg. And uh, he in fact succeeded in getting his foot to the ball, but it bobbed up out of his hand for four. So the crowd loving it. That's the 50. 50 to Greg Chappell, a most welcome return to form. As again, the luck goes with Chap a little bit because we saw Holding bring off a piece of footwork that saved the ball in the last over. This time, Andy Roberts just a second division soccer player, not a first division, unable to prevent the fall. Greg Chappell's 50 coming in 90 balls in 125 minutes. And the crowd at the MCG relieved to see the Australian skipper reach that half century. Again, Plato on the leg side and the crowd getting on their feet. They're loving this and it really is good news from Australia's point of view. Chapel must have a sigh of relief as that 50 went up on the board. Holding to Chapel. Well played by Chapel. That's a good shot. Off the hip. Hit away down towards deep mid wicket. Once again, Logie screaming across the ground there as Chapel turns for the third. Three more for Chapel. Holding beginning to take. A little bit of tap from Chapel. It's going to be interesting to see how Yardley handles him. Roberts to Chapel. It's here. That's out. Straight to cover the charge. Justin Logie doesn't miss many catches. He's a great fieldsman. Well, with ten overs to go, a little hard to understand that shot of Greg Chapel's. Coming down the wicket to Andy Roberts. Shot that's not quite on, hit it in the air. And a good catch by Luggy, just getting to him, just getting the hands underneath it, wrapping them around it. And the end of Greg Chapel 
He's on his way back to the pavilion and now Australia 7 for 140.